Election Day is one week from today, and candidates for Maine's Senate seat are making their final pushes to win the spot. Chris Costa looked into some of the claims candidates made during last night's forum. Hey, Lindsay, yes, State Senator Eric Brakey and both and Zach Ringelstein both bashed Senator Angus King uh, for where his money comes from and how he votes. We're trying to cut through some of that political rhetoric and answer some of the facts. Claims flying about Senator Angus King's voting record during Monday's debate. You run as an independent, you tell us you're an independent, but you vote 92% of the time with Chuck Schumer. The Senator Angus King works with Trump 47% of the time, votes with Trump 47% of the time, is a complete and utter disgrace. First, that math does not add up. Second, some of the votes are procedural or ceremonial, which makes these claims hard to verify. So let's look at one issue, health care. Google Trends shows Mainer searched health care more than any other political topic since 2017, according to independent website 538. Senator King voted opposite of President Trump's stance on health care related measures five out of six times since January 2017, voting no on different repeals to the Affordable Care Act. He and President Trump voted in step on a measure to expand private care options for veterans. Another one of the top five most Googled political topics in Maine, guns. Here in Maine, we have the strongest Second Amendment protections in the entire country. We're also ranked the safest state in America. In fact, four out of the top five safest states in America are all constitutional carry states. In a U.S. News & World Report article, yes, Maine was rated the safest state. We ranked second in the country in a similar Wallet Hub report. And Brakey's claim is true. Maine, Vermont, New Hampshire, and Idaho, which are in the top five of that U.S. News report, all have constitutional carry laws. Whether that right to carry directly affects safety, Ringelstein and King disagree. I mean, this Do is. Do we really want to be a society where people have guns no. in churches How? and no. schools? And the thing is, this is classic, this is classic is Eric Brakey. Criminals don't obey gun laws. You can pass whatever law you want. Criminals don't follow it. We might as well make the state of Maine a murder free zone. In fact, I think we already have. But people are still committing crimes. They don't follow the laws. Law abiding citizens do. You're disarming law abiding citizens with, with these laws. Well, if you missed any of that Senate debate, you can go to our website, newcentermain.com, and check out the entire full Senate debate. And also chime in and join the conversation using the, hash, the hashtag MESenateDebate. Lindsay? All right, Chris, thanks so much.